Alright, welcome back everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Another day, another trash picking day. Let's add to the episodes. Very, very fun. A very nice day so far. It's going to get really hot today. Uh, but yeah, trash picking once again. Let's go. You guys already know the deal. It's trash picking day. We try to find anything we can reuse, resell, or take to the scrapyard. Essentially saving the earth one piece of junk at a time. Let's go out there and see what's in the trash day and let's make in our fun one. What do you say? Let's do it. I guess we'll start off with our favorite friend. I guess we'll start off with our favorite friend. Wow, this one's heavy. Had to check to see if the tank was there. What do we have out here? Hey, look. It's grill day. Ooh, is that aluminum door on the other side? Uh, no, it's not. But this is an aluminum sheet. Or sheet of aluminum. So I got a piece of siding and some uh, quarter, I don't know what you need, corner beads for your window, your door. To probably uh, switch out your screen door to your storm door. getting really weak because all these grills weigh a lot. This one doesn't even sit flat. It's going up. The whole like frame is just shot. Tires. Looks like the raccoon got into that. Oh wow. Garbage really doesn't smell the best. Got some bed rails. Got some bed rails. I was gonna say you can always count on bed rails, but you can't really count on bed rails. It's actually a spot right there. I used to find, probably about a year ago, I used to find a ton of stuff. They must have been cleaning out like a kid's closet. Uh, like the kid it's from like the 90s or in the 90s. All sorts of great stuff. Action figures, sports clothes, you name it. Just doing a little street scrapping. Man, imagine how many chairs, it, well, remember how many chairs we found yesterday? There were so many. Those screens. Oh. Still continuing on. Alright, back into the swing of things. Remember there was a time where every single day we went out trash picking and it rained? It has not rained here on a trash day or on a flea market day or anything for a very long time. To the point where my basement sump pump finally doesn't kick on every 30 minutes or 15 minutes or an hour. 
that? Oh, just boxes. Person over here in that stone house on the corner threw away a bicycle last week. They got a bunch of garbage out, but who knows what they got. Doesn't look like anything. Nothing over there. What do we got on the yardies? Fake flowers. This is garbage. What is this? This is. No, it's not. Oh, it's always on the bottom. Take that out. Don't need all this stuff. This just looks like typical glassware. Nice. Might be the only older piece in there. I'd actually say this is probably mid 70s. I don't know what that. What the heck? I don't know what that other stuff is. Uh, that. What's the word? It's not raglan. I don't know stuff I don't need but there's all like a bunch of clear glass in there clear glass faces all right I saw it there and I was like I need to have it I absolutely need to have it It's all jacked up. Must be stuck with some mud or something in there. The right wheel also doesn't spin, which there it goes. Doesn't spin as well as it should. Swing up here. Is there anything to the left? That's one random small store. I don't even have a parking parking lot for it. Alright. Main Street Market. A little grocery store here. Uh, we're going to swing up to this upper side where there's just a screwdriver in the road back there. We're going to swing up here where at that, uh, that lawnmower was the other week. And then we're going to experience the new side of town where last week we found that awesome gone with the wind lamp. Oh, funny. Wow. Alright. My bad. Just gotta pull out far that you can't see him. Well, that sucks. I'm usually pretty good with that, like recognizing that stuff, but I just didn't even see him. on the right threw away a bunch of vintage what do we got up here got something threw away a bunch of vintage uh, stuffed animals now run them up there to the, the market here in a couple days do you think somebody would want that I think it's in rough shape Elevator still work? Oh, out here playing, making bells and whistles. It's a nice tick just hanging out on that cooler.
give the old kick test. Barely saw this. Whenever they're painted brown, they're very difficult to see against brown furniture, wood furniture. Some more bed rails. Kind of funny how we don't see them for a couple months and then you find two in the same day. way too hard for what it should have been. The last snag of the day, because I just went down half of that road, um, was this like one of those over the toilet shelves? All right, let's, all right, there we go. Maybe this goes over your toilet now? Shelf rack, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. That thing is, it's cool. It's, it's funny how the, uh, the elevator still works. Where'd that thing go? There it is. Actually, uh, I actually sold one of these the, uh, the last flea market day. So I think I got two bucks, but like I said, I think it was worth about seven cents in scrap. All right. Well, this is what we found. This is what we found on today's episode of Trash Picking. Bunch of metal, bunch of grills, call it taco grills because it seems like that's all we find. It's always going to shock me because now for like the, uh, wait a second. Where's that piece? What the? Well, it looks like I'm buying a piece now because I don't know where that went. That's probably going to be something stupid like 40 bucks. Anyway, uh, it still does amaze me because I think uh, last year, I think, uh, or next year, I'm going to say, uh, we're going to just find more and more grills. It's like people just replace their grills and it's, it's one of those things where we're going to just keep finding them forever. Uh, and that's going to be a, a whole fun adventure next year. But I'm still shocked we're still finding grills even after Memorial Day. Because I feel like that's the big cookout day. And when people decide, hey, look, we should buy a new grill rather than, you know, a couple weeks after. But, hey, I'll recycle them. We got a bunch of bed rails as well. And this mailbox, I did sell the last mailbox at the market. So I think that will not be scrapped. Uh, that will be also brought up there and hopefully sold. We have an iron uh then pretty much everything else is just metal there's that one fisher price toy that one fisher price toy with the old elevator every time it reaches the floor the thing hits the uh the old bell that's kind of cool uh amazing you know how, how toys have definitely changed over time but yeah i even remember i think this is from probably the 70s uh i do remember playing with these when i was a kid uh just because I think uh, they were very, very common at flea markets and yard sales in the early 90s. It was just one of those kind of toys. So uh, that brought a little blast in the past. But yep, more metal to be scrapped, more metal to be recycled. Hopefully you guys enjoyed yet another trash picking adventure. It's always a blast. Uh, thank you guys and gals for all the support recently. Uh, and I, I greatly appreciate it. You know, the channel continues to grow every day. And you know, I really do appreciate that. So thanks for that. If you guys want to see more, you haven't already subscribed down below. If you guys enjoyed the trash pick adventure, hit the like button for me. I greatly appreciate it. I'll catch up with you guys next time for the next adventure. And until next time, well, have a great day. Keep living a dream. Peace.